Hi again, dear viewers. Nandi Di Fiancé star Larissa De Santos Lima was taken into ICE custody on Saturday. ICE, the Immigration and Custody Enforcement Agency, took the reality star into custody after she posted a largely successful lingerie show to Cam Soda. While preparing for a road trip with boyfriend Eric Nichols from Vegas to Colorado, where the couple just closed on a new home, Lima was met by ICE agents. She was promptly taken into custody, pending an investigation into her immigration status. According to TMZ, Lima and Nichols have been documenting their real estate journey quite successfully, and the reality TV star had a recent and massively successful lingerie show that she posted to Cam Soda, a video streaming site. Lima's Instagram story got an update from Lima's good friend Carmen Nice, which let fans know that clearly there had been a misunderstanding, and Nice and Nichols were headed down to an ICE detention facility to get things cleared up. Us Magazine reports that this isn't the first time Lima has been arrested, however. In 2019, she was taken into custody for domestic battery during her marriage to Carl Johnson. Johnson filed for divorce that same day and the two have split despite continuous contact since their relationship ended. At the time, Lima's attorney assured fans that after consulting with her immigration attorney, this negotiation will not impede her ability to obtain citizenship. It is unclear if that has changed. While no reason is currently forthcoming on why Lima was taken into custody to begin with, there is a large portion of Americans who feel that ICE either frequently overstepped their authority or has too much authority altogether. There are also some who feel the organization should not exist at all. These sentiments stem from widespread reports of cruelty on the parts of both the ICE agents in charge of taking immigrants into custody and deplorable conditions for those detained at facilities near the border. Of course, that could also be due to the fact that Lima does not have custody of either children, making it especially easy for her to move countries, which she did to marry Colt Johnson, and also to spend thousands of dollars on a new, updated version of herself. Regardless of her motives for making money or for moving, ICE seems to be taking no risks in its sweep to deport immigrants from the United States, and apparently no one is safe from the so-called long arm of the law. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.